everything you need to do today and now it's okay for you to relax Your shield allows you to heal deeply, keep out, and repel all of that negativity. Hello friend, I hear that you've had a pretty stressful day at work today. I found while you're settling down, just taking off your earrings, your necklace, your hat, your shoes, while you're settling down, I've got some things that are just going to help you to relax. and. Don't worry about anything, I've got you completely taken care of. If you want to just tell me how everything went today, I'm happy to listen. I'm just here to listen. We're not looking for any solutions to any problems, just here to release all the stress from the day and all the tension. You go ahead and just take it easy, find a place to relax. If you need me to wait here for a second so you can get into something more comfortable in a more comfortable position. If you need to get some pillows or some blankets, just whatever you find relaxing for you. But I'm just working on creating this little mix for you. This is um, just a solution that's really good for de-stressing at the end of the day. Something that I created just for you because I know that it's been really overwhelming everything that you're trying to get done recently. You've just got a lot going on. And the days are just crazy hectic, right? You just feel like it's non-stop. And the funny thing is everybody keeps telling you to take a break and you just want to scream at them and say, I do not have time to take a break. When am I going to do that? And they say that the ideal scenario that can help you to reduce that stress and overwhelm is to do a task and then take a break do a task and then take a break. But what is so funny about that is there are so many jobs nowadays, there's so many jobs and being a mom is one of them that just don't let you do that. You can't always choose to just do a task and then take a break. It's not quite that simple. But I'm glad that you have a chance to take a break. So let's just work on refilling your cup, refilling your emotional bucket so that you can go back to work or the crazy stressful day that you have tomorrow and not feel so overwhelmed by it. Because I know that things are crazy and I just want you to have a moment to relax just for you. Okay? Alright. Do you feel like you're in a more comfortable position now. Okay, good. Alright, so this is just a little solution that I created for you. I was hoping to just uh, rub it on your hands and maybe a little bit just around your temples, around your face. Just give you a little bit of a hand massage and a base massage help you to just release that stress, recognize that it's totally okay to do something for you right now. Okay, and this is just a coconut and sugar scrub, but I made it with a little bit of my secret ingredient. It's a deeply healing concoction. And the secret behind it is that it doesn't just help you relax now, but it actually physically fills up your emotional bucket. So even tomorrow, you can actually handle the stress better. Okay. I'm using my child's baby spoon to mix it up because it's nice and soft. And we don't need any of those harsh metal spoons, we're just going to use these nice soft spoons. Okay. I think it's 
almost ready. going to take this, put a little bit on your temples. Okay, very good. All right, now let's rub some into your hands as well, okay? You want to give me your other hand? Thank you. And while you're relaxing, feel free to just tell me everything that went down today. Sometimes it's nice to just let everything go. Sometimes you just need to talk. How is that feeling? Is that any better? Okay, good. Just massage that into your hands. Teach you your fingers. I know today didn't go quite the way you were hoping it would. I probably still have this huge list of things to do and it never seems to get done. It's okay. You did what you needed to do today. And it wasn't everything on the list, but you got the most important things done. I'm proud of you for that. You're doing a really good job just sticking with it, pushing forward even on those hard days, because I know you're not just doing this for you. Alright, do your hands feel nice and relaxed? Good, okay. Now just take a few deep breaths. Okay, as you do, I'm going to go ahead and light a calming candle for you. It's one of those wood-burning ones. It's got a really nice crackling sound. my favorite candle that we have right now and it lasts forever we've had it for four years now and it's hardly even used and we do light it quite a bit it up so you can smell it. The scent, it says that it's zesty citrus tangelo blended with satsuma and blood orange. I'm not sure if I pronounced all of that correctly, but you can smell it. You can kind of smell that citrusy scent. I'm gonna smell it. Before we light it, you can already feel yourself relaxing. Your eyelids may be starting to grow heavy at this point. Feel free to let them fall shut if you need to. Just relax. Let go of any guilt or any stress 
regarding the things that you didn't get done, but just feel some gratitude for the things that you did get done because you got done today what you needed to get done. I love these wooden lids as well. And they say that connecting to the earth is a really good way to feel grounded and to feel more whole and more at peace. I feel like this wood is in a sense a part of the earth because it grew from a tree in the earth. It helps me to feel more connected. and light this candle for you. And just listen to that crackling sound and you can just relax, continue to take deep breaths, find your breath, find your relaxation. You did everything you needed to today and now it's okay for you to relax. It's okay for you to take a break and refill your cup so you can do even more tomorrow or again know exactly what you need to Imagine that these waves, these flames, and the smoke coming off of them, and the scent coming off of them, that this is coming into your nose, where you can smell it, but then it continues to flow through your whole body. And as it does, it's healing you. Refilling your cup. It's helping you to relax and feel more rejuvenated for the coming day. I'll set this somewhere where you can continue to listen to it, okay? symbolism. I 
also made some soap for you while you were away. And this is the soap. Again, it has another one of my special ingredients in it. This ingredient is designed to help you let go. Let go of the things that didn't get done. Let go of your expectations. Let go of the expectations of other people for you. All that's left is you and the wide open blank slate in front of you because you get to choose what tomorrow holds and healing what's inside right now is a great way to set yourself not just now, but in the future. And healing yourself, focusing on unlocking your present, little by little. Every single day creates this beautiful flow of energy through you. and your hands so we can wash away any lingering stress any lingering tension and completely wash it away so that you can completely relax and get the deepest most rejuvenating sleep of your life Let me go ahead and put some on my hands, and then I will go ahead and wash your arms and your hands, okay? Go ahead and give me your other hand, your other arm. Very good. Very good. All right, so then you go ahead and just rinse it off. Just taking some of those deep breaths again. You have this scent of lavender all over you. Okay. You also have this nice citrusy scent coming from the candle. Just breathe in those scents, okay? And then as we breathe out, we are just letting all that tension just release and go away. Okay. So let's take a deep breath in. Ready?
try to breathe in for about half the time that you're breathing out. So we could breathe in for about four seconds, breathe out for about eight seconds. Like, breathe in for one, two, three, four. Breathe out for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. Now at your own pace. Very good. Also brought some of these little can candles for you. These are rose scented. We have lots of nice scents tonight. And I chose rose because I wanted you to have a sense of self-love. You know, sometimes we bring roses to people that we love, but maybe we should bring roses to ourselves. I know that sometimes you are hard on yourself because you don't feel like you're getting enough done. You're always falling short. So these are for you to feel a sense of self-love and recognize that you are enough and that you are doing everything that you need to and you're getting the most important things done and that you do a lot more than you a lot of times we just don't see all the good things that we're doing every single day. You smell the rose. 
Remember, this is self-love. And right now, when I light each of these candles, I want you to think of one thing about yourself that you are grateful for and actively thank yourself for that thing. It could be something that you're good at. It could be something that you're learning. It could be something small that you did today. It could be something that you do every day. It could be a person that you're caring for and you're grateful that you have the ability to care for that person. Just think of something with each candle that you are grateful for and thank yourself. Give yourself some love and gratitude for that thing. Okay? Let me light each candle. Here's the first one. Okay. What are you grateful for? What about yourself are you grateful for? your second candle. What else are you grateful for about yourself? What do you love about yourself? What can you say thank you for? yourself to really feel like gratitude for yourself. Here's your third candle. What else are you grateful for, for yourself? What are you going to say thank you? Send yourself that self love. Now, here's your fourth candle. I want you to tell yourself something that you love about yourself. And repeat to yourself I thank myself for this thing. I send myself love. I wish myself the best in life. I send others love. I wish others the best in life. I forgive myself for my shortcomings. I forgive others for their shortcomings. I am learning new things every day. I am getting better and better at handling stress and increasing my productivity. And I know how to have that clarity for what things are most important to get done every single day. I send love to myself. I send love to those around me. I send love to those who create negativity in my life. And I allow their words to bounce off of me because I get to choose what affects me. And I choose to let only positivity into my life. I am protected by a safe, warm, and light shield. 
that kicks out and keeps out any negativity and only allows in that positivity and warmth and light that helps me to heal and rejuvenate daily and in each moment. Very good. Just one more thing for you, and this is going to solidify your shield. We just talked a little bit about that shield. That shield is something that we use to protect ourselves from any words or any negativity that may come your way, and this is going to keep you safe from that negativity. Okay. I created this formula to strengthen and heal and energize your field. I just put it in an empty perfume bottle because that was what I had, okay? So I've got the box here. This is a perfume that my sister got for me when she was visiting France. And it now contains my special formula for strengthening and healing your energy shield. This is a shield that we create around you to help you be protected from any negativity, negative influences, any harmful words that might come your way and create stress in your life. And what's so powerful about this shield is that allows you to choose what you are going to allow into your life and what is going to affect you. Because at work, at home, with friends, family, associates, unfortunately we cannot control the things that they say, the things that they do, even the media that surrounds us. There's a lot of negativity are a lot of expectations for you to be a certain way, to get so many things done, to be a superhuman, and your shield allows you to heal deeply and keep out and repel all of that negativity, anything that does not serve you. So we only let in the things that help you to feel healed and happy and healthy and that are aligned with your purpose and your vision for yourself. So as I spray this special formula, it's just going to strengthen and heal your energy shield and help you to have more of that control over how your life is created and what affects you and how it affects you so that you can create that positivity in your life every single moment of every single day. Let's go ahead and spray some of this special formula onto your energy shield to strengthen it and help you to heal. Right. So 
now that you have this strengthened energy shield, if you are getting ready to sleep now and unwind for the day, this shield will continue to stay with you throughout the night and it will be ready for you when you wake up. It protects you always. You get to control what comes in. So now I will just go ahead and count you down to a restful sleep so that you can fully enjoy the healing benefits of living within this energy shield and just feel fully relaxed. I'm going to go ahead and bring back our crackling candle to help you relax as we count down to sleep. I'm going to count down from 20 to give you a little bit more time to relax and fully close your eyes and fully release any tension and start healing within your protective shield. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, feeling your body growing heavy, 14, 13, 12, 11, Ten. All your muscles are sinking into the bed. Nine, eight, seven, six. Feeling deeply relaxed and healed. Five, four, three. Heavier, heavier. Two, one. Now rest.